Association and the American Soccer Club. Executive Committee of the Newmark, proposed Newmarket Mosque and its congregation to speak to you today about um, our plans to establish a mosque here in, uh, in Newmarket. I wholeheartedly support um, the idea of establishing a mosque here in Newmarket to serve the, the Muslim community here in, in our town. Uh, for years now, we've been, we've been praying out of a basement uh, facility in a store in Aurora. And frankly, that's simply not a sustainable solution for a community that's growing. In my own opinion, in my humble opinion, we need mosques. We need churches. We need synagogues. We need community centers. We need recreation centers. We need places where, within our communities, we can gather together as friends and neighbors and bring together different faiths and different backgrounds and start building bridges. Um, and tearing down walls. You're right about breaking down those walls. It's an opportunity to, to learn and to grow our community, not to divide it. And I'm really liking the, the outcome and the direction that this is taking place. I think we, we need to work together and, and not divide it. Uh, so I, I very much thank you for, for what, what you've said, and uh, um, I'm really looking forward to a positive outcome to this. I know a lot of members of council are really concerned, and, and I'm concerned, and I know everybody else is concerned too, and, and it's only through communication that we can get beyond that. Thank you. The site plan application for 700 Mulan Drive appeared on the council agenda in August of 2006. Based on the deputations to Council, the letters to the editor in our local newspaper, and the comments that I've received directly, no one has objected to the establishment of a mosque in Newmarket. And it is clear to me that our community respects the rights of our residents to attend their own places of worship. Thank you for your deputation. And uh, all those in favor of receiving a deputation. As Terry, thank you. And, uh, Given how controversial this is, did you get any calls or emails to your office, uh, you know, protesting this at all, especially after last time, last week's meeting? Yeah, there's been a number of emails and phone calls that I've received, and as many in favor of as uh, as objecting, and uh, and as I said earlier this evening, for a large part, the people that are objecting really didn't have all the information and uh, really didn't have a good understanding of what was going on, uh, and I think that's why we really need to go forward with with opening up the lines of communication. So basically it's a done deal once they uh, submit their site plan, correct? That's correct. When you see the number of people that have turned out, when you see the number of people that uh, come from the interfaith communities and their commitment to make sure that this happens, it's very reassuring that uh, it's the kind of community that we're all very happy and proud of. I'm also here because I know uh, personally Zafar Bangash, who is one of the people that uh, who's been particularly singled out for uh, attention here. I know uh, I've had the pleasure of, of being at his mosque, of being uh, entertained there, uh, and shown great uh, uh, hospitality and understanding, and I believe that 
that if, if the same kind of mosque was here in the, in Newmarket as, as is there in the, in York Region, that uh, that uh, this this would be a real boon for this town. So uh, I hope people also will approach the mosque when it is established and go and find out for themselves. So uh, what a fine community this is to uh, to be part of and take to, and to to uh, to build links with. I think that the stability of our society, the success of our society, is based on very open, tolerant, accepting approach and a rejection of the mosque, uh, a rejection of the Islamic community would have been a real setback for Canadians as a whole. In my riding we've had an attack on our local mosque and I learned from that and from previous problems with intolerance that the community has to stand up, make it very clear that intolerance won't be accepted and that those who are getting that push against them will have people standing behind them. Oh, I'm extremely excited. I'm, I'm as a as a, as a Muslim, and more importantly, as a as a resident of Newmarket, I'm delighted with tonight's outcome, and, I, and I'm uh, just really um, pleased with the overall sense of uh, of inclusiveness that was so apparent in in the council and in the words of Mayor Van uh, Van Bynen. So I couldn't have asked for a better uh, better outcome.